Australia's central bank has cut interest rates to a historic low. This puts the Reserve Bank among the first in the world to erase or to ease policy due to COVID-19. The RBA has slashed its benchmark cash rate to 0.5%, a move that had been expected by many traders and economists. The outbreak has hit Australia's tourism and education industries particularly hard. The word coronavirus was mentioned nine times in today's statement. Um, it's clearly driving uh, policy decisions and the, and the decision to cut to a historic low today. Um, and it's really, I think, about addressing and trying to mitigate some of the downside risks to both domestic and global growth from this virus. And that's effectively what the policy action was about today. This is the fourth interest cut by the RBA in less than a year. Economists say it signals the bank's aim to keep the currency under pressure. The Australian dollar rose as much as 0.5% immediately after the decision. RBA chief Philip Lowe says it's hard to predict how large and long-lasting the effects of the epidemic will be. But he says the bank's ready to ease further if needed. Analysts expect RBA to further cut to 0.25% in May or June. But they also caution against the bank's monetary easing if it's paired with long-term stock losses. BlackRock says COVID-19 is driving an uncontrollable bond frenzy. Further interest cuts could send Australia's 10-year bond yields into negative territory for the first time. Bond yields have already tumbled or to record lows on global monetary easing bets. But the RBA won't have to face the fallout alone. Prime Minister Scott Morrison has pledged policy stimulus measures targeted at jobs, cash flow and investment. He also urged major banks to do their part in curbing the economic fallout from COVID-19. The government would absolutely expect the four big banks to come um, to the table and to do their bit in supporting Australians as we go through the impact of the coronavirus. Um, that is why if the bank were to go down that path, they would be going down that path.